drink champagne I'm totally vibing It's true what they say It's all about time Hi guys, C Chronicles here. Welcome and welcome back to Unscripted. If you're new on this channel, please do consider subscribing because there's never a dull moment. On this channel, I do vlogs, fragrance reviews and anything and everything to do with my life. Now, if you're returning, thank you so much for the continued support. In today's video, I'm going to show you my jewelry collection. Now, when it comes to my jewelry pieces, guys, I've got a friend who's a jeweler and he gave me a crash course in how to make fine jewelry. Now, what I do is I do make pieces for myself as well as for anyone who wants to put orders with me i'm not saying i'm about to start selling jewelry on youtube but i just wanted to explain this part guys in case you see some of the pieces is very thin obviously i'm going to be explaining each piece to you and i hope you find this video interesting enough to watch till the end and i'll see you guys in the next one okay guys so this is part of my collection well i just love jewelry making as a hobby i'm going to insert uh, photos where you'll see me in the workshop making some fun pieces i like making most of these pieces for myself and for friends uh, you know i just got into jewelry making because i love to, to create stuff of my own so having a friend who owns a jewelry shop i just thought okay i want to learn a lesson or two about making jewelry so uh, most of these the pieces here are um 18 carat because 24 carat in its purest form is the hardest to it's not that sturdy here are some of the pieces that i'm just going to show you here Okay, these are all designs that I came up with myself. I love clustering, like a cluster where you, it's kind of like where you put a ring on a ring on a ring. So, you know, these are some of the pieces. This is another one. You know, so I will get inspiration sometimes from magazines and stuff like that. And then I get into the workshop and work on, on them. This was actually my wedding band. This is how this whole band stacking started. So we were adding a band for every year of our anniversary. And this, let me just wear it for you and then you'll see. It just got to the max. Got to a point where I can't really fold um well, I can fold my finger, but I mean, as in, I couldn't add any more. It was just too, too big. So that is my wedding band. Um, my, my partner passed, so he's no longer with us. So, but this is just something that we kind of created together. Okay. This is another one with uh, cluster diamonds. It's a little ring. My daughter wears this sometimes, and I made this one for her as well it's got a little diamond there and this one says see this is still a work in progress i'm going to um try and see how i can develop this because this is c as in my initials okay but i am not done working with this ring this is just another one this is another one that i'm still working on you know this is another one that i'm still working on Here's another one. This has got that because I sometimes wear this on my neck. So it's just to hang it. So I deliberately put the, that other, you know, like ring there with loops so that I can put a chain in between. Here's another one. Oh yeah, let me see if I can wear this for you. But I am still, I want to flat lay this because it's still high up there. So don't judge this based on this. I'm going to flat lay this. And this is the stone we found so far. So, so far, so good. It's cubic, it's a corner. And then the next piece is this one. I wear this all the time. This has gunnet. I wear this all the time. And then this is my chunky chain. This is also my own creation you probably you may come across this somewhere as a design but this is my own creation and reason why i started doing change as well is this is machine made this particular one and it broke so you know i just said i'm gonna learn how to make chains as well because it's pointless and then this is another one this is a pattern that a lot of you guys might be familiar with okay that's and then the belt, decided to do a belt, you know, I decided to do a belt. I am actually contemplating opening a jewelry company, a jewelry company where I just do my own creations. This is, uh, pardon my nails, guys. I work so much, there's no time for nails, so 
pardon that this is another one with like flat lay diamonds this one and then this there's this one as well let me just wear that for you so you see for yourself this big piece is for this hand this uh sorry this finger it does bend so that's what i was trying to wear for you it does bend that's how it looks like so this join is in the middle okay let me see if i can push it because i am holding a camera with one hand and doing this but my finger does bend completely so okay there you have it it goes all the way down if you can see what i mean it's just that it's not workable with one finger like with one hand but that's how it looks and then there's this Okay, so yeah, that's it guys for my jewelry collection for people who were interested in knowing. I have an Instagram page, but it's not that active and uh, I do personal designs. I am looking into possibly starting a, a, opening a shop around it or something. But for now, I just thought, okay, let me just show you some of these pieces. And then, uh, yeah, for those who wanted to see my jewelry collection, that is it guys. Thank you so much for joining me today. That one just fell. Thank you so much for joining me, guys. I will see you. I will definitely see you in the next one. Check, check this out. I will see you in the next one, guys. Bye.